Well, building the workforce skills sufficient to ensure the business gets the competences it needs to prosper. We know, don't we, that Britain has lagged behind in terms of skills compared with France and Germany and America. And that means that our business is less likely to be able to compete. So establishing a system which allows people to gain the skills they need to get jobs and the business needs to become more productive. Government's doing its bit and we've put in record investment into our apprenticeship programme. We're in the biggest apprenticeship programme in modern history. But I think we can always do more to make the system more demand driven, to make it more sensitive to business need, to uh, make it more easy to navigate both for learners and for businesses who want to engage in the skill system. So we've gone a long way, but the journey is by no means at an end. Full employment has never happened, actually, uh, they, you know, they, they, in, in practice. But what's certainly true is we can't live with long-term structural unemployment at the level it's been at now for a very long time. This isn't actually a feature of the current economic circumstances. If you look, for example, at youth unemployment, there have been a persistent large number of young people not engaged in education, employment or training for a decade now. Uh, now, I think we can do a lot more to create those uh, opportunities for people uh, that allow them to get jobs and keep jobs. So let's tackle unemployment. But the idea of full employment, every single person having a job every day of the week in Britain, has never happened in any economy, I don't think. But certainly we need to do much more. I want to create jobs. I want to create growth. I want to create a Britain that's better for all its people. I think particularly on this issue of uh, pre-employment uh, uh, training, the, uh, the pre-apprenticeships we talked about, making sure that you have the prior attainment to get to the point where they can uh, access the skills system. I think that's a real challenge that came out of today's uh, seminar actually. And I think secondly, making sure that the link between the available jobs, the, uh, the gaps if you like, the shortages in the labour market and the people who might fill them is made more effectively. Someone said, I think, uh, during the game the seminar today, that you know the various areas of the economy are growing and those parts of the economy often claim they can't get the people they need. And yet there are a lot of people out there who want their opportunity to get a job and prosper. I think getting that link better uh, and using the mechanisms available to us to do so is another area that requires further work.